What's up YouTube? I got another pair of shoes that I have been wanting to get for a long time, but I've never had the chance to. These are, as you see, a pair of Yeezys. Basic cardboard box, nothing too special about that. All right, if you open it, it says foam right away, like that. And then tissue paper, foam, some foam runners. All right, I've wanted to get these for a while. Just didn't want to pay crazy resale. These should all go for crazy resale prices. Yeah, so it's going in there and then the runner. It's like an inverted box. Runner in there and then the color on this one is Antoka Mix Granite. That's what that, I think that's what that says on there. And I'll put the original, the official um, colorway of these when I put the YouTube video up. So right away, you have a pair of foam runners, all foam throughout, silhouette. Um, they look kind of funky. They're a little different for me. I haven't worn something like this. I've always wanted them, but dude, they go for a lot. I've see, always seen them go for like 100 plus. And online, they're like 90 when they release. So I've never been able to get one. I actually cop this recently. Adidas had a big like blowout sale. I guess they're getting rid of all their Yeezy products. So I bought these for $72. So I think reselling the pair of these go for at least 150 to 200. I could be wrong. Don't quote me on that. But I got these in a size 10. I usually wear um, size 9. But I wanted to get something. I heard these run a little small. So I wanted to get something that could be roomy and comfy. And I've tried these on. And so far they are really comfortable. So on this side. I am can't really give you too many details. There's a bunch of holes in them. You got a big hole here. A smaller one here. And then the smallest one here. This is reminiscent to me of the adidas three stripe logo one stripe two stripe three stripe something i noticed and it's the same on the interior side of the shoe more perforation holes on top all through here so you got a mixed gray colorway all throughout and i'm just gonna show you guys the details with the light that's the heel all right and it's a dark gray upper with some light gray it looks like flames Splat, not splatter, more like flames. The pattern that it is, and here's the top of the shoe, and here's the toe of the shoe. So I'm basically making this video. I know it's not a new new release. It's part of a re-release. I doubt this is a new colorway, but anyone's interested in this colorway here, you can check this out. If you're interested in buying them on StockX or on your own Adidas, and you're worried about it, how it's gonna look, because the pictures for these shoes aren't that accurate, in my opinion. So those are the toe box. All right, and the pretty thick uh, foam layer. Definitely comfortable. I've tried them on, the interior of them. You can try these on with socks. You can wear them with socks. You're wearing barefoot. They feel real good either way. Um, the interior of the insole, if you were to call it that, is nice and um, has a pattern to it. It has a texture to it, so it feels good on your feet. And then last but not least, the outside of the shoe. That's the outsole. has a pattern to it as well. Has a little bit of texture for grip, but I definitely can see these uh, the grip wearing away pretty fast just because how soft the materials are. I wouldn't see these lasting forever, but they look really cool. They're uh, I got them for a really good price. I'm be walking them when I don't feel like uh, wearing my shoes because they look really comfy. So just showing you guys how they look. Y'all make y'all decision. Let me know what you think. I know Yeezys aren't the craziest most sold shoe anymore but at one point these were really fire and a lot of kids still wear these um i see them on feet here and there but they look pretty cool to me and i got them for a good steal so now i'm going to be wearing them i didn't think i'd buy them at the price that people were selling them for but for 70 bucks compared to what they usually go for i thought it was a good deal so like i said i got these in a size 10 they do run small i've always heard they run small i put them on a size 10 and they fit perfect so that means they do run small so, because if not, I've tried size tens like on regular shoes, and they fit too big. Thanks for watching. Let me know what y'all think.